Hi everyone, welcome back to my video where I unbox a number of Louis Vuitton items. My last video was the Pegas 55 Business in the Monogram finish and I only uploaded that quite recently. And I used it for the first time last week on my trip to Melbourne and what a great bag that is. Last week was amazing. I, I went to Sydney and Melbourne and I specifically wanted to see some Louis Vuitton items. In particular, I wanted to see the Clarence bag. This is a bag that is in the monogram finish and is in the A4 format. One that I think is particularly good for a work situation. I went to the Sydney store in George Street because that was the only place that it was uh, available to, to view. And I had a good look at it there and what a great, great bag it was. Um, now, I didn't buy it on the spot because um, I wanted to think about it. Uh, later on that week, I, I actually went to the Collins Street store in Melbourne and looked at other bags. But while I was there, I ended up buying the bag from Sydney and getting it delivered to me here. Um, and here it is. And it's, look at, look at the way it's come packaged. It looks fantastic. Um, here is the uh, beautiful box with the receipt. They've put this wonderful blue uh, ribbon around the whole box, which is which is lovely. Um, so here's the receipt. There's not much to tell you about it. So you know it's real, and and although I went to the store and viewed it uh, in the George Street store, I did buy it. Uh, I should say I bought, bought it online. I rang them and they sent it to me from their online store. So it wasn't a you know an internet purchase. So I actually rang them up, and I did that because you know this is actually quite a big thing to lug back if you're going to travel on a plane as I did, um, look, it's it's just easier to get them to send it to you. Uh, if it was smaller, then that would have been alright, but it wasn't. It was actually quite big. So here it is. I'm just going to open it up. Let's take off this nice ribbon and open up the box. And, of course, there it is, the dust bag inside. And we'll remove the dust bag. And there it is. I think there are only two of these in the country. One was in the George Street store and one was available uh, online. And as you can see, uh, it is in the monogram finish. It is A4 sized. And it has these wonderful buckles. Um, and a few few uh, you know pockets which are zipped up at the back. Now why why did I uh, go to Sydney and not buy it? Uh, I, I actually wanted to compare it to the other bag uh, which probably rivals this in the monogram finish and that is the district in the MM size. Now I've got the PM size, I've done a video on that one which is a great little bag, in fact I took it with me on the day, great little bag to um, house an iPad, an iPhone and wallets and a few other little things but no good for an A4 fold or anything like that so not good enough for work um, but it actually comes in a bigger size, the MM which does have sufficient size for uh, an A4 uh, format uh, inclusion but this I think is a better bag uh, it is a little bit more pricey I have to say but uh, it is a better bag so for a start it's got these clips so let's just open this up Okay, and straight away we've got this pocket here, which will fit an iPad or anything else that you want to put in there. Let's take out this packaging. And inside there are compartments. Hopefully you can see that. Obviously a number of zipped compartments, but there is a place, there's uh, pockets for phones, pockets for um, uh, pens and things like that. Uh, and should you want to, you can put a folder in the middle here and another component here for a laptop if you wanted to put one in. The District MM doesn't have any of that. It, it, it is just a box inside. It's just empty. Whereas this has compartments um, which is nicely uh, arranged to organise your contents, which is really what I liked. Um, so this, is, I just thought, was a little bit more business oriented. And again... I specifically wanted it in the monogram finish. 
There are a number of bags that are available for men in the A4 format, but this is really the only one I thought suitable in the monogram finish, and I think that is a much, much nicer bag in every way. So there it is, just a quick video to, to show you that. Um, uh, now, um, having uh, been to so many Louis Vuitton stores, I actually did buy a number of things uh, this week, and so I will have a number of videos um, where I will show you what I've just hauled from the Melbourne store. So I uh, will see you later. Bye-bye.